back breast like this is for two people. You see a lot of fat, but we don't eat the fat. So to prepare, we just open the bag. We have to take this part. You always have this. This is some nerves and fat here. We just remove that. Okay, like this. And now we turn the fat, we turn the, the chicken, the chicken, the duck. And we take a part of the fat. Not all. You will not eat the fat, but I will explain why. I we assume we're gonna use it for flavoring somewhere. It's just to open a little bit and to to make the, the peel bracing. And now we do that. We don't cut the meat, but the fat only. That's scoring? Scoring the fat of the duck first. That's all. We only do that, and now we put it in the pan. Now, you must be very precise in the, uh, in the time. I have to take a timer. It's better I will take my timer. Yeah, sorry. Uh, we will put the duck breast six minutes on the fat side and three minutes on the uh, on the other side. So one. medium heat and I start. This is very important because you don't have to cook too much. And after six minutes, you will see a lot of fat. I will remove this fat in the sink. I will turn the meat for three minutes. And after, I will make a papillot in a, in a, in a, um, in a dish with the sauce on the top. Can you explain again what's in this sauce right now for the carrots? Uh, the sauce is uh, per uh, magret you need two big shallots or three, medium. You, uh, you chop the sh sh shallot, you peel the shallot and you chop it. And after you put in a, in a pan with butter and oil. And after when they are a little bit golden, you add one tablespoon of any kind of honey. You mix until it's like a caramel mousse. And after that, you add one tablespoon of uh, cider vinegar. And you mix until it's a little bit thick. And then that goes in with the carrots? Yes, the, car uh, the carrots now. You just peel the carrots. You cut them in uh, big pieces. You put them in water for 15 minutes with salt. After 15 minutes, you remove the water and you put them in a glass of chicken stock already prepared. And you add one tablespoon of uh, butter, unsalted butter, and one tablespoon of sugar. And you put again on medium heat until no liquid in the pan. And look at that duck coming up. You can see all of that duck yes. fat is beginning to come off the duck into the pan. That will be removed. It would be certainly very healthy to remove it. But uh, duck fat is also used for a confit chef. Yes, but uh, as I do a lot of uh, uh, duck breast, I don't keep it. I, I have a lot. But you, you can keep it.
I preheat my oven. I will take this big castor iron pot and I will explain what it is because it's interesting to know. This castor iron pot is very interesting. This is the crozet and do you have a shallow in the cover? And do you know for what it is? This the shallow in the cover? It's to put ice cube because when you put these on it and ice cube here, you improve your condensation, they make drops inside. If you don't have this kind of shallow on your castor iron pot, you put a plate with ice cube instead of that. But this is very clever. And that's when when you actually have it in the oven? To, to start or to No, finish? no, no. It's only when you put it on the induction, you know. Not in, in, in the oven, it's not necessary. Oh, okay. No, no. It's just when you want to cook a, a chicken, for example. I have a recipe. This is a chicken with two vinegars. So I cook this in, in this uh, castor iron pot, but I put ice cube on the top. Yes. Okay. On the top of the shallow here. No, I'm not turning it off because I got questions. 